Hey guys, this is Sarah at CrossFit Rokius and I'm working with a patient and something came up about overhead shoulder stability. She's struggling with just her shoulder blade isn't working necessarily or moving the way that it should and when she lifts stuff overhead she's having some trouble keeping the weight in an, a single position and like feeling comfortable and confident in where she's holding that weight. So we did a little bit of testing of some muscles and I'm going to flip the camera around so you can see it but I'm just gonna have her hold her arm directly out to the side. Now, if you look here, this is the deltoid. This is really, really strong. It's really kicking in. I'm gonna push down on her arm out here, and then we'll see what happens here, here, and then over at the shoulder blade here. And I'll explain a little bit more after we do that. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply some resistance. So hold nice and strong. Okay, turn the thumb down a little bit, okay? Hold again. Okay, so it's a little bit hard to see in the video. You can go ahead and relax. But her deltoid and her triceps down here were really kicking in to help try to stabilize that arm when what really should have been happening is the rhomboids in here kicking in to help stabilize it. These are muscles that are commonly undertrained in a lot of CrossFitters, and strong muscles here will really, really help with overhead shoulder stability. So a great exercise to do to improve these is simply raising your arm directly out to the side. Yep, and your thumb here, so how you hold your hand changes what muscles you use. So you can point the thumb up, and then a different variation is going to be pointing the thumb down. This simply just changes whether or not the middle of the trapezius is being used or if the rhomboids are being used. So rhomboids are the bad boys, and that has their thumbs down, and then the trapezius is thumbs up. So depending on which muscle you have more weakness in, you can move your hand back and forth. And with this, a lightweight goes a long way. So you can go ahead and put your arm down. So try like maybe three, five pounds, see how that feels. You want low reps and high weight to get the best strength gains possible. Usually around three to five sets or so, maybe shooting for about five to seven to eight reps tops if you really want to focus on strength. Taking about a minute or two, two to three minutes really rest in between. Making sure that when you finish those reps in that set, your arm is exhausted and tired. But just kind of going back to it, raising that arm up, working on that is going to help you a lot with feeling more stable overhead and being more strong, whether you're overhead pressing, whether you're jerking, whether you're snatching, any of those things. Or even if you're taking your suitcase and you're lifting it into the overhead compartment, if you're traveling on an airplane, this will help a lot with that too. So hope you guys found that useful and have a great night.